Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be showing you another video tutorial. This time a 3D heart shape with envelope distort text effect. But before that, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment on this video. I am now in my Adobe Illustrator software application. To start, we are going to draw first a background for our artboard. To, to do so, Press on the rectangle tool and then match the size of your rectangle according to the size of your artboard. Then change the color according to your choice. For me, I'm gonna choose this color. Then press OK. Next, we are going to draw another rectangle. But this time, the color of the rectangle should be black. Then click again on the rectangle tool. Draw a rectangle at the center of your artboard. Okay. Then, rotate the rectangle by pressing the shift and then pointing the mouse on the corner of your rectangle. After that, duplicate a copy of the rectangle by pressing Ctrl C and then Ctrl F. Again, rotate the rectangle but this time on the opposite side. Okay, select both the rectangle that you have created. Then select the Shape Builder tool. Press on Out on this portion while dragging your mouse to trim the excess shape below and then release the Alt key and then drag on these partitions here so that it will be treated as one object after that click on the direct selection tool make sure that these four corners will be selected by pressing shift while clicking on the four corners. A dot will appear indicating that the four corners is selected. After that, point your mouse on any of the dot and then drag to have a rounded corner. Next, click on the selection tool that is letter V on your keyboard. You can either press V or select on this icon to activate the selection tool. Then adjust the size. This time, we are going to draw a curved line on our heart shape. Press on the brush tool. Make sure that the fidelity is on the smooth. And then press OK. Select white stroke for your brush so that it will be emphasized on the black heart shape. Select the selection tool and then adjust your curve. Then select both the objects, the heart, and the curve line. Then click on the fat finder and then click divide. On your heart shape, right click and then select and group. Okay, so your heart now is divided into two portions after ungrouping this one and then this one. Next, we are going to add a text. I'm going to choose Arial as my font. And then select the block with 72 point. And then type love. 
okay then duplicate your text by pressing ctrl c and ctrl f and then move it on the other side then select the layers make sure that your text is below the paths that you have created next select the text and a portion of the heart shape and then select object hover on envelope distort and then click make with up object again do this step on the other text select object envelope distort and make with top object okay so you now have your love text on your heart shape this time you're going to group them together select the two object and then click on ctrl g after grouping them select the object and then go to menu object and then click expand then press ok select the object again and then go to compound path and then press make this will allow us to change the background color of our heart shape later. Next, create a copy of your object by pressing Ctrl copy and then Ctrl F. Then press shift and then adjust the size of your heart shape. Okay. Then make sure that the smaller heart shape should be below the bigger heart shape drag it on the center change the color into the background color select both the object and then go to object again and then click blend and then make select the object again blend and then blend options then select specified steps and make this 100 then press ok on your layers click on the blend and then then make a copy of this one press ctrl c and then ctrl f and then move it at the top of the blend group then change the color into white okay then change also the color of this one into red then change the color of this one into black Okay, so there you have it. You now have your 3D shape with envelope distort 3D text.